eye. If your eye be single, then your body will be full of light. That is what is said in Bible. The pine cone which I told you the name came from the pine cone. This symbol is a very mysterious emblem and it is found in many ancient and modern art architecture. We have a next slide. See, this is this is a court in Vatican City. You all know Vatican City? Pope, Pope, Vatican City. And this is a symbol which is there in present of the uh, court. And it is called Court of the Pine Court. That means here the decision will be taken with the spiritual knowledge. There the third eye of the pineal plants complete functions will be considered and the decisions will be taken. That's why this symbol is over there. Next. Uh, and here you can see uh, in the Pope's staff there is a pine cone symbol and even that says in indirectly indicates the control over the pineal gland from the Pope. Okay. The next slide. Okay. Like that we can see in Indonesians, uh, Babylonians, Egyptians, many. Next slide. Okay. I was talking about serotonin, melatonin and dimethyltryptamine which are the three chemical compounds that get separated from the pineal gland and their benefits I would say, which is next slide, next slide, okay, this is the theta wave which I told you, theta stage that child goes to, see here you can see very few crests, can you see that very few crests you can see? So the brain waves are only 4 to 7 cycles per second, otherwise brain waves are multiple cycles per second. So this is a very very relaxed stage of the brain. Okay, And this theta brain waves can be considered the subconscious and they govern the part of our mind that lies between the conscious and the unconscious and retain memories and feelings for a long time. Okay, next step. Okay. The benefits of melatonin to be to go. How does it work? Was your question, no, sir? What does melatonin do? What does serotonin do? What does dimethyltryptamine do? Is an answer for it. So melatonin is a powerful antioxidant, and it supports normal sleep patterns and the ability to function and think clearly. The clarity comes. And melatonin also has some benefits, like it prevents us from the infection, inflammation, and autoimmunity disorders. It inhibits cancer and you might have read many articles like people who are in the night uh, jobs like uh, staff nurse and uh, some of the companies who work in the US work in the night shifts. They all have more tendency to get cancer than the people who work day, who work in the day because melatonin secretion happens only in the relaxed stage where your brain is completely relaxed and our body can recognize the darkness and pineal gland can get activated only in the dark in the relaxed stage and for such people unfortunately that doesn't happen so melatonin secretion doesn't happen in there that's a problem and attention deficit disorder and insomnia gets cured by maintenance activation it's an anti-aging supplement you will look young <laughs> you look young you might have seen uh, meditators like some of the sages who look really really young compared to their age and they live very longer. It's because the melatonin secretion is very high in there. Melatonin is a very good anti-aging supplement. That is why they look really really young. So meditate. Next. Okay. Serotonin is a neurotransmitter and serotonin helps to relay the message from one area of the brain to another. And in, in normal uh, cases where I said the secretion doesn't happen properly, that's why the recalling ability or there will be too much of problem in uh, keeping the memory for long. And serotonin takes care of that as a neurotransmitter, serotonin helps to relay the messages from one area of the brain to another because of the widespread distribution of the cells. The, if you see the structure of the serotonin, it has a widespread distribution of the cells. It is believed to influence a variety of psychological and other body functions. I told about the emotional stability, which I gave the example of brain, interpersonal relationships. The one who can see many of the business goes only based on interpersonal relationship. If you are good with the people, you will be good in many things. 
So, certain thing takes care of that. And for children, it is basically with the parents, with the teachers, with the friends, and happy living. They feel good to go to school. They feel good to go to sports. They feel good to play. They feel good to get uh, get along with their cousins. That's what in children. But this is the results are permanent. So you will see the effects even when they are adult. In terms of body function, certain it can also affect the functioning of cardiovascular uh, system, muscles, and various elements of endocrine system. That's a bit of science. Okay. Dimethyltryptamine is another chemical compound that gets released and uh, the ideal levels of the DMT it's also known as God's medicine DMT is also known as God's medicine in spiritual sciences sir. once the DMT is given to them they feel as if they are God itself that's what spiritual sciences say so DMT, the ideal levels of DMT in the body can be life changing opening them up to new ideas, spiking creativity and in some cases, alleviating the fear of death due to the sense that there is some way for consciousness to go beyond the physical fear. So this is all available. The data is all available over the internet. So you can go through it and um, you will get much more data. And this I got it from a research by Dr. Strassman uh, funded uh, foundation. Okay. Uh, in Hindu mythology, we know Lord Shiva who has the third eye. For always you see Shiva meditating. Shiva meditating. What happens after the meditation? Melatonin gets secreted. That's the main concept behind it. Lord Shiva's third eye is so active due to meditation. And as I told, that kind of meditation, that kind of dietary habits are really difficult to follow in this current era. So, taking them to theta stage helps in secretion of the melatonin to that extent. Lord Shiva and Buddha. Buddha also had his third eye activated. Buddha. And these two are the best examples that I can give. Next. Okay. This is about how pineal gland and the eyes are similar. There are some animals still have third eye. Uh, you might be knowing about lampreys. I don't know how many of you know. Lampreys and Tortora, they have third eye still existing. This is something that I wrote because if somebody asks, it will be helpful to show them. So this is how it works. Your answer is here. So it's science and the spiritual science behind. It's a God's gift. It all exists. Only thing is, it's in the dormant stage.